Hello, my name is Kurt Jensen, and I'm a certified technical expert at Hank Greff Chevrolet in Davidson. The video you're about to view should give you a thorough explanation of how things work. I personally viewed it myself and found it to be very informative. Enjoy! For child seat installation on any Colorado model, be sure to follow the instructions provided by the seat manufacturer to ensure proper attachment of the restraints. Also, detailed information on the installation of child restraint seats is found in Section 3 of the Colorado Owner's Manual. Be sure to use these instructions to ensure proper attachment. On the extended cab model of the Colorado, it will be necessary to remove the rear outboard head restraint to do this press the button on the head restraint and pull up. On the passenger side, store the head restraint in the holes on the front of the seat cushion. The result is a larger flat surface for the child seat to rest on. There are exposed metal lower anchors for each rear seating position attached to the back wall near the seat cushion. The top tether anchor in an extended cab model is an exposed loop above the seat cushion. When attaching the seat, Start by attaching and tightening the lower attachment to the lower anchors. At this time, the top tether can be attached. To reinstall the head restraint, press the button on the head restraint, insert the posts into the holes on the top of the seat back. Push the head restraint down until it locks in place. I hope that video presentation is a confident on how to operate your personal car technology. If you have any questions, please contact me by phone, email or at my website www.graphguru.com. Thanks again for watching and have a great day.